Beautiful. All right. Let's do this. Um, sentence. Um, I'm gonna bring the music down just a hair. Just a little bit. Let me know if anything is too loud or too quiet, and I will adjust as we need. As we need to. Stalker no stalking. All the stock. All the stock. All right, let's do this. Let's play this game. Um, select an episode. My body count is at currently at zero. So we have done nothing. We are going completely fresh into this. Uh, they were warned. Now they are doomed. Crystal Lake memories. Uh, I think I just need to start. Yeah, this one's locked. Unlocks at 15 kills. So let's just do it. We have classic Jason, the gold standard in psycho killing. This timeless look never goes out of style. And it looks like there's some different ones you can unlock. Supermax Jason is not locked in here with you. You locked in here with him. <laughs> These are awesome. All right. All right, let's do it. Let's get some gameplay going. July 13th, 1984. Camp Crystal Lake. years ago, a boy drowned in Crystal Lake because the camp counselors weren't watching him. In the following days, they started to die one by one. They were murdered by the boy's mother, Pamela Voorhees. The counselors cut off her head to stop her. Now her son Jason stalks these woods seeking revenge for her death. Wait, wasn't his mom seeking revenge? <laughs> yeah, didn't he drown as a kid? Whoa. Uh, wait, maybe I'm not telling it right. Oh God. <laughs> This is so good. All right. What level of gore would you like? Definitely not PG. We're going full on R. <laughs> Crystal Lake Carnage. Let's do this. All right. Jason, sweetie, you must avenge me. Use arrow keys, gamepad, or drag your mouse to move and attack. I will be using arrow keys. So, um, it looks like I can go... Murder that bitch. Get her ass. Get her ass. Alright, uh... <laughs> this is so good. Amazing. Alright, Bloodlust rank 1. Slaughter slide, level 2 of 13. I think there's a lot of levels to do in this. Um, such nasty, nasty campers. Slide on over there to punish them, Jason. Right, Mom. <laughs> oh shit. I didn't expect the thing! These dudes do. <laughs> oh god, I'm crying. This is amazing. Alright, one last one. Come here, baby. Oh, fucking right through the stomach. So good. <laughs> that rated our gore. It's so good, Valley. You have to pick it up. You have to. It's awesome. Nobody can ever beat. My ultimate upside down car strategy. It's true. It's true. <laughs> Except maybe Jason. Jason might be able to handle it. Uh, punish them for what they did to you, Jason. For what they did to me. Kill for mother. All right, mom. <laughs> I got you. All right. Um, I don't know if we have like a limit on how many moves we can do yet. I imagine that'll come at some point. Um, <laughs> uh, let's go this way. Something like that. Oh my god. <laughs> so I wonder what's going to happen when I completely fill the mask. Why do they run from you? You're such a special boy. And today is your birthday. <laughs> it's so good, Daddy. <laughs> so good. Yeah, definitely feel free to check it out, guys. If you feel free. I'm sure if you have any questions or anything, you can ask uh, ask Brand in chat. Will they do the sleeping bag one? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We're gonna be playing this for like four hours. So we're gonna see a lot of game. I'm very excited for this one. Alright, um, movement here. I can pretty much I pretty much have to go down. Oh, oh, oh. oh shit, they run from you. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. 
motherfucker. Okay, that is going to be an interesting puzzle mechanic. The movement. I didn't think that they were going to move at all. That'll make things a little bit, a little bit trickier. <laughs> Valley's on her way. <laughs> Been doing such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra bloodlust. Now go get them. Thanks, Ma. Fill me up. Ooh. All right. Rank two. Smashing the crate. We got our crowbar. Can we equip this? I have to use my mouse for this. So I wonder what the crowbar does. Remember, Jason, if you ever need help, you can always tap me for a hint. All right. Um, things are going to start getting more complicated. I can already see this. Um, wait, crowbar. What do I do with the crowbar? Can the crowbar, like, break things? Or is it just to attack? Oh, I need to go around like this. Or is it just for the animations? Maybe it's just for the animations. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, first eight episodes are free, so feel free to download on Steam, guys. I think it's also available on iOS and Android. <laughs> These kill animations are too funny. Too damn funny. Punk panic. See how they run at the sight of blood? Kill them, Jason. Do it for mother. Kuma. Got you. All right, so I could go in hard, just straight on this guy. Uh, I think that's the plan, actually. Let's do this. This dude's gonna run, and then I can go like this. Dude's gonna run again, and then... Gotcha! Finish him off, Jason. <laughs> Splattered. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was. I thought it was an iOS and Android. I can see this working really well on, uh, on the touchscreen. Those filthy little campers, how dare they try to hurt my special boy. I'm okay, Ma. I'm okay. They won't hurt me anymore. All right, so we can see our final destination is the X. So we want to kind of work our way towards that. Um, how am I going to get over there? If I went down, it's going to kind of put me in a loop. We'll see this. It's going to kind of loop me around. So that's not going to work. Um, I could try this. That'll work. That'll work. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. This game is too funny. They got creative with these. It's like every single one is unique. I love it. I love that every single kill is like unique. Indirect hit level 8 of 13. Hey, Dark, how's it going? Be careful around the lake, Jason. You're not a strong swimmer. Oh, damn. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. So, if there was no lake here, I would have gone left and then up. But if I go left, I'm going in the drink. I do not want to do that. Oh, wait. How do I do this at all? Every direction I'm going to be going in the water. Maybe I needed to not end up in this square. Yeah, I need to reset this room. Because every direction that I go, if I go left, if I go up, if I go down, I'm going in the water. So we got to reset. We got to reset. Drowned. Okay, cat. Okay, cat. Cat's all up in here pushing windows keys and stuff. Let's get a good look at this cat. It's a good cat. <laughs> Lurking half asleep. All right, Dark. No worries, man. Good to see you. Good to see you. Jane's in school. This game is fun. Have you played it, Dark? Really? Awesome. Yeah, apparently it's free to play for a lot of the uh, first episodes. It's pretty cool. Press uh, rewind to restart the level or back to go back one turn. I think I'm going to restart the level. Pretty sure I'm supposed to be in a different spot for this one. <laughs> Let's go. Thanks for the five bits. Appreciate it. <laughs> That's a good cat. Yeah, she's, she's a pretty good cat. 
I think I need to approach from a different angle. Possibly. Like that. Probably used too many moves there, but that's okay. We're not judged on the moves right now. Oh, right in the eye. <laughs> oh, man. Kitty. All right, she's going to have a, a nice little lay down. Lay down on the lap. You've been doing such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra bloodlust. Go get him. Thanks, Bob. <laughs> I haven't played it, but watched this gameplay. Mark a while ago. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Nice. All right, we got a crate. With a sickle. A bronze tier sickle. I'll take that. Basement dweller. Have I told you how special you are, Jason? You're very, very special. Not today, Mom. Not, not enough. <laughs> that scream. Um... Now, I'm stuck. I'm officially stuck. I can go left, I can go right, and I can't do anything else. So, it's about time to, uh, to reset that. So we need to take this a little bit differently. This might be something to do with scaring. I'm trying to think. Ah, that's it. That's it there. Just had to move around that first guy a little bit differently. <laughs> nice. Nice. Classic. Classic headshot. Alright, Jane. See you in a bit. Incinerator. Ooh, the fire's gonna mess us up, isn't it? You can scare those campers into the fire! Punish them for what they did. I will. Get in the fire! <laughs> I love it. Oh god. Alright, and you're going in the fire! <laughs> I'm just gonna murder you. And you're going in the fire! Oh, that's too good. I love the, the Dead by Daylight style skill checks to get the final kill. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. <laughs> huh. Be careful, Jason. If you get stuck, use the rewind button to start over. Gotcha. Now, obviously it's setting me up to get stuck. I want to see what happens here, though. <laughs> yeah, I love Dead by Daylight. Love it. Let's reset this room. So, I need to take a different approach to this guy. I cannot end up on his left side. I need to be elsewhere. So, I need to do something like this. That'll work. Yes, this is the Friday the 13th we've been waiting for. The NES couldn't deliver. Friday the 13th that came out like last year. Boy. Couldn't deliver. In my opinion. But this. This is great. So good. Don't forget to change your weapon, sweetie. Use the weapon icon in the bottom corner. Wait. Unlock some deadlier weapons, sweetie. Drag three you don't want to trade the trade slot. How many different weapons are there? There's loads of them. Holy crap. Yo. This is cool. I think maybe you get... In the crates, maybe you get extra... I wonder if you can get duplicates. When, when they were saying like the drag to trade kind of thing. Maybe if you get duplicates, you can like trade them in. That's kind of cool. We're going, we're going to go with the classic. We're going with the classic here. <clears throat> this is the chosen one. 
I enjoyed the It movie. I like the uh, original a lot as well. I I I should say I like the original. I I watch it now and I'm like, wow. I used to love this movie when I was a kid, but it's like so cheesy. Still love it though. Still love it. Get in the water. All right. So no one can swim in this game. Swimming is death. They look so drunk. <laughs> oh man. So there's a ton of different weapons and different kills you can do with the weapons. You're doing such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra bloodlust. Thanks, Ma. Good head to see it with friends. It's heavy. Deadly afraid of clouds. Oh no. Level four. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, let's crack that open. We've got ourselves a cane. So, it looks like these are tiered. It says bronze tier. I wonder what's going to be, like, the higher ones. If there's, like, silver and gold and stuff like that. That'll be kind of cool. And maybe they'll have, like, special finishers based on how, uh, how good they are. That could be kind of neat. Yo, Azir, what's up? It's the last one, Jason. Vengeance is yours. Okay. How do I do this without getting stuck? I can't go down. I can go left and then up. That'll mess me up. If I go up, that'll mess me up. I have to go right. No matter what, I have to go right. Um, Like this. Oh, this is cool. A little cutscene. Oh, get him from under. No? What's happening? <laughs> Got him. Oh, I love the X's. Oh my God. This game is too funny. <laughs> Alright, so done with uh, episode number one, I believe, which is they were warned, now they're all doomed. Crystal Lake Memories. So Crystal Lake Memories is done. We got all the kills. The body count is at 24. So that means we're on to the next one. Orange is the new dead lockdown. Let's do it. Super Max Jason. He's not locked in here. <gasps> oh, should we try Supermax Jason? I think we need to try Supermax Jason. We have to. We have to. Silver Tear has a bone you went past. Oh, I didn't see that. I need to try that bone out. We gotta try that. Playing Dark Souls, gonna try recording there. He's got the new Silver Vegas bottle. Hey, Zero. Nice. Let me know how it goes. Doing well. How about yourself? Orange is the new dead. It's so good. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Thank you for the stock. Let's go. Two X Jason's rad. What's going on, Cold Cash Cow? How are you? Turn classic Jason again for a sec. Right. And he's gone. Cell block. All right, what was I going to say here? Time for a prison break, Jason. Don't let the guard stop you. I'm curious if I switch. Wait a second. <laughs> well done. All right, if I, uh, if I back out of this, um, where is my selection? How does select who I'm playing is? How does I do that? I'm not sure. Do you have to do it after the episode, maybe? Oh, this is cool. You can see all the individual levels. Nice. Nice. Hit play. Oh, yeah, I don't... I don't know. It doesn't matter. We're just going to play it up. We're going to play it up. I want to watch this one more time. Get this mouse out of here. man walking. <laughs> I'm so shocked. 
All right, cell blocked. Time for prison break, Jason. Don't let the guards stop you. I'm assuming we're gonna do this for science. I'm assuming this is gonna kill me. Freeze, police. Yeah. All right, so we don't want to get shot. Let's uh, let's restart this. Is there a uh, key bind to fast restart? Do you guys know if there is one? I don't have to use my mouse at all. Ah, oh, yeah, knife to change weapons. Right. Where's uh, where was that silver at? Right there. Oh yeah, so you can see based on the like border, I want to call it. It's not really a complete border, but like the thing in the corner, the color of it. Ooh, we have a few of them. So we got a bone. We've got like this kind of mace. Oh, and here's a gold one. So you can see it up top too. Ah, cool. There's tons of weapons then. There's loads of them. Equip different weapons for variety. Oh, wait. Oh, no, never mind. Trade in three old weapons. I was thinking like you could have multiple weapons equipped or something, but maybe not. I'm cool with just having one equipped. All right, so we can't go in hard on these guys. I need to take a different approach. If we go around the side, we can splatter them. Final convict. They updated to convict too. <laughs> All right, thanks, Brand. Appreciate it. Yeah, it might be like R or something to like restart. I'm not sure. I gotta try a few different finds. Uh, the initiative found you guilty, Jason. You were acting in self-defense. Right, Mom. Let me, uh, whoa. How the hell do I do this? If I go left, I'm going into his crosshairs. But I can't go up or down. Whoa. Oh can't end in the space. R is rewind. Cool. I was thinking it might be that. Beautiful. Thank you so much. All right. So I just can't end in that spot. I need to do something like this. Boop. And... Boop. Final convict. Oh, I only have to kill the convicts. I don't have to kill the cops. That's something worth noting. <laughs> I murdered all those kids in self-defense. They were coming at me. They were looking at me funny. I had to do it. <laughs> this guy was trying to get away from you. Watch out for those holes. Now I'm stuck. Yeah. Okay. Rewind it. Bring it back a couple steps. We need to do this differently somehow. I can't go on the top left of him. I need to go from the bottom. Somehow. Huh. Oh, 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 there we go. I was like, I'm not seeing it. Now I see it. There it is. Smash his face. Whoa. <laughs> he turned him into a pancake. <laughs> That's so good. All right, we're gonna switch up weapons. I wanna, I wanna keep trying out different ones. Careful, Jason. You don't have much time before the SWAT team arrives. <gasps> okay. Now we have a time limit. Now we're getting locked into a time limit. So I can only take six turns to kill everything. Here's where the game's gonna start getting more more challenging, I think. And I really gotta start thinking. But I see it. <gasps> no, out of turns! I thought I had one left. Hmm. So it'd be one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I can't I can't make it to him from here. I might need to completely reset. You son of a bitch. Shadow. I did this once already, but Thank Twitch you. is being twitchy. Underscore. Underscore. <laughs> Thanks, Shadow, for the for the sub. Two months. Thank you so much. Can we get some uh, some hype in chat? Spam the hearts. Give me some hearts. 
Thanks so much, Shadow. Yeah, Twitch is being borked. Twitch is being a little borked. Appreciate it. When it says Final Convict, I think, finish him. <laughs> Got it. Appreciate it, Shadow. All right. So I can't just go straight down on this guy, I don't think. It's going to put me in a bad spot. But what won't put me in a bad spot? Unless I'm overthinking it. I feel like I have to go down. Like, one move to get a kill. Because getting in that other one is going to be tricky. Let's try this again. Let's try from here again. I need to look at it a little bit longer. <laughs> Thanks for all the hype, guys. Appreciate it. Um. Oh. That's the path. I took a different path last time. Kill! Almost full. All right, fill me up. Awesome. Rank five. Does that give me a crate? I think every time I rank up. Yeah, every time I rank up, it gives me a crate. A teapot? Uh, yeah, we're equipping that. No doubt. <laughs> you had to restart the level. Should be T. You have to have used rewind at least once first. Cool. Thank you. So I need to, if I want to restart level, I do R and then T. So I'd like rewind once and then T to restart. Cool. Thank you. I will uh, keep my fingers on the buttons. Appreciate it. Uh, use your scroll wheel to zoom in and out. It might give you a new angle on the situation. Oh. Interesting. I think this view is working okay for me. I can still see everything. Um, this one, I'm not locked into a certain set of mute of moves. Um, how am I going to take this guy out? Like that. Final convict. Got him. <laughs> you shoved a teapot through his back. What? <laughs> Love it. Those guards look dangerous. Maybe don't fight them face to face. Alright. Um, we will fight them in the back then. That's yeah, a very sharp teapot. Oh, I love it. Um, processing. How do I get in there? This is a tricky spot. I'm not seeing this one. I may have messed up right off the bat. Um, if we keep them alive and use them. I need to end up in like this one of these squares. I need to somehow end up in one of these, but there's nothing like blocking that's letting me in there other than maybe the guard somehow. Hmm. Hmm. 
I feel like again I messed up right off the bat. Thanks, Lime. Can you guys hear that all right? Or should I turn it up a little bit? I might need to turn up the uh, stock a little bit. I'm just going to do that. There we go. A little bit louder. L of C. L of C. <laughs> While annihilate this, watching his prey, waiting for the right time to strike. Yeah, I'm looking. I'm looking. Hmm. So I know I need to end up in one of these squares. The only way I can see that happening is if I attack from here somehow. So I just got to reverse operation this. I need to go from here. I need to kill this guy here. So that means I need to do something over this way. I need to be in one of these squares. But I don't see a way to do that either. Is there any other options? Hmm. Not yet, let's go. Not yet. Let me think about it for a minute. Oh yeah, you can click on her for a hint. I feel like I'm on the right track where it's like, you have to die last, you're second. You don't even need necessarily to die unless I need you for positioning. I'm gonna look at this for one more minute. And if I don't get it, I'm gonna get one hint. I'm not sure how, uh, how hinty the hints are. I love the blood drip. That's cool. Um, I'm trying to figure out how I could get to here. What if I somehow loop my way around here and then landed there, there, there? If I can get up here. Oh, got it. Got it. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Hey Stomper, how's it going? <laughs> Final convict. There it is. Boom. Oh, no, I don't want to mess this up. <laughs> so it's interesting. It's uh, it's free to play for the first, I think, eight episodes if you want to download it, Stomper. It's free on Steam, uh, iOS, and Android. Feel free to check it out, dude. Used to make meatloaf for you, Jason. Do you remember? Such a sweet boy. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> I love Jason's responses. It's always just like one word or like a couple words. So good. Okay, that last puzzle was pretty good. I was, uh, I had to think a little bit more on that one. So, I can scare these guys into the fire. No! Get wrecked. And how about you? Get wrecked. But now I, now I can't get to them. Now I can't get to the final convict. Without... And it needs some flames. So we need to back that up real quick. Reset. Reset. We need something a little bit different. Um, that's not the answer either. I could try... No, starting with this guy. Starting left is going to mess me up. How do I kill the guy on the left? How do I kill the one on the left? That's the question. Let's try that other view. See if this helps me think at all. Uh, 
Um, what if we did like a back approach kind of thing? Like this. There we go. That's it. That's it. We just switch up weapons after this one too. Every kill is different though, which is amazing. I don't think I've seen a, like a repetition of a, a kill animation yet. It's so fucking cool. Ooh, I nearly missed that one. I wonder if you have to restart the level if you miss that final kill. Or like what happens. I might try that just to see what's gonna happen if I miss the final kill. <laughs> Teapot's the best. It's pretty good. It's the sharpest teapot I ever used. <laughs> Who would have thought you could shove a teapot right through someone's uh, through someone's chest cavity? Pretty damn good. All right, so I'm sitting on a couple silvers right now. We've used both of those. I don't think we've used this yet. We're gonna try this one out. All right, so these guys are getting guarded pretty hard. Um. Oh, we can do something like that. This dude's gonna get spooked, and then we can get in there. Murder him. Stock's probably too quiet, unless you guys tell me it's, uh, it's okay. I've been doing such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra bloodlust. Gotcha. The new schedule got approved. Start day shift on the 24th. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome new stomper. Trade in the bronzes? I don't know. I kind of want to have one of everything. If I get, like, I don't know if there's duplicates. I don't know if there's duplicates. We're using a candlestick. <laughs> no doubt we're using a candlestick. How are you going to murder someone with that candlestick? Doesn't look like the way out, Jason. Keep looking. Unless he uses, like, the blunt end, I guess. But I imagine he's going to do something crazy. He's going to, like, stab him. With the candle. Um. Alright. The game is wanting me to go left. But it's probably going to mess me up going left. But we're going to try anyways. Move first, think later. Oh shit. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, so here's where I figured I was gonna get stuck. Now I can not get to this guy. Yeah, so now we need to reset. So I thought that was gonna happen. I need to kill you last. I need to end up going zoop, and then I can kill this guy. That's the only way I'm gonna end up stopping here. Or somehow, or this way. I can go this way and then kill there. So I need to end up in one of these two squares. Um, how do I do that? I wonder if the scary mechanic could somehow do that. Does this guy get scared? If I approach from the back, it doesn't do it. Okay, let's back it up. Reset again. Yeah, I think the stock is probably too quiet for you guys. I'm gonna crank it. Let me know if this is loud enough. I'm gonna hit one myself. The thing is, there's already a lot of stock sound in the game. But I want you guys to be able to hit it as well. Alright, um... Yeah, so I need to end up in one of these squares when I murder this guy. But they need to be after. That's better? Cool. Thank you. Thank you, Shadow. Um... How do I want to do this? See, the thing is, like... Murdering you, though... I can get... I can get at you from here. Like this. And get at you straight on. 
but I don't know how to actually get at them unless I scare this guy. How do I do that? Yeah, it sends you all the way. Yeah, as you can see, it's just like you push one direction. It's just like zoom, zoom, zoom all the way there. Are you ready? Wait, what? <laughs> That's a hit. <laughs> Oh, you're saying like right up or right or something like that. I'm going to play with it for a second. All right, let's reset this. Let's reset this. All right, so I think Levsko goes saying right up, but then I can't do right again, so I'd have to do something from here. Probably left. Which will kill me, get the kill on this guy. <laughs> I have no problem resetting these kills because they are fucking hilarious. They are so funny. All right, now I'm stuck in the same spot where I can't get to this other guy. I need to land in one of these squares. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> the candle is OP. Probably my favorite one so far. I need to land here or here. Not yet, let's go. Not yet. Chill. It's okay. I still want to try the in-game hint system. I want to see how that works too, because I haven't I haven't tested that yet. Um, if I go up, I can land here, but then I can't get to that. If I go this direction, I can't get to him at all. Same thing with this direction. So I can only kill him if I go up, left, down. Because right doesn't take me. Left doesn't take me. And down doesn't either. So my only option here is to do this. Murder him. And then I can't get to the last guy. So, I'm curious about testing this out. Let's see what this, let's see what this says. Aim out on the left is especially disgusting. Save them until the end. I figured that much. I figured that much. All right, let's try this again. I know we need to save him until the end, 100%. 100%. So, I liked kind of how we were starting that. Um, what did we do here again? We do this. And then again, I'm in the same spot. So right, up, right, doesn't work. Up, left, down gets the kill. Then how do I get to the last guy? How do I do that? You're doing it wrong. I thought so. Yeah, this spot doesn't work. This spot doesn't work. 
So I need to be in a better spot to get to one of these squares. It has to be one of these two squares to end on. Has to be. So I need to figure out how I can end up in one of those. Um. Yo, Skywork, what's up? What's up? <laughs> how do we get there? Could have gone with the last one. I could get this guy, but I couldn't get the last one. New Howard Jones stuff? I don't think I've seen any of that. What is that? Let's go. No face bobs. Makes me feel bad. <laughs> Makes me feel bad, dude. Alright. Um. Yeah, we need to start in a better spot. We need to start in a better spot. Wait, that's not the beginning. Oh, it is the beginning. Uh, let's do something different. These tunes are dope. I'm trying to map out the paths. So if I was on this guy, here for example, I can't get to that from this side. Can't get to it from this side. <clears throat> I wish I could almost scare this dude to go here and then do it here. I need to loop in here and then over. All I need to do is end in one of these spots. I'm fine. Okay. Uh, what did I do last time? What did I do again? Um, I went... Now I'm overthinking it. How did I kill this first dude? Now I'm not even remembering. I'm blanking. Um, let's see. I can't go up. I need to go right for sure. And then... How to do this again? Oh yeah, here we go. Like this. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Look it up. There we go. Got it. Got it. Oop. I'm loving this fucking candle. It's so damn good. So damn good. Bloodbath. Okay. Um. They're all like lined up right here. And I can't go over to that right side where the cop is at. Or else he go murder me. And I feel like it can't be e as easy as I'm imagining. I feel like I, I mean, I have to do something like this. Because the game is not that nice to me.
But getting that dude is going to be impossible now. There's no way to actually grab that. Nope. Reset. So I can't let that, that guy get scared. If I go this way, he's going to get scared too, right? Okay. I need to figure out how the scare mechanic works exactly. Um... That size can get scared as well. And for the final kill, it's not a big deal to get the final kill. So I don't need to worry about that one at all. Yeah, they do look high, don't they? So from here, I can attack this dude, but then the other one gets scared. And once he's scared, I'm pretty sure he's in a spot that I can't reach him. Yeah, I do this. He goes all the way over there. Once he's over there, there's no way to actually get to him. And this cop can't be killed because he's always looking in front of him. So that means... That means the dude on the right needs to die first. I'm pretty sure. But how do I get to him? How do I get to him? Hmm. The music bork? Yeah, the music bork for a second there. We reset it. Um. If I attack head on, he gets scared too, right? Yeah, he always runs to the right, no matter what. Unless I can find like a different approach. So if I go left, that doesn't help me at all. So left to start is no. Up to start gets dude on the right running all the way to the right. Running to the right can get me coming up behind them. So I think I have to start with right no matter what. Right's definitely my first move. <laughs> Keep exploring someone's left. Yeah, I, I would run to the right as well. I would too. Um, from here we can go up. Well, we have to go up. We have to do that. So I think we have to start with those moves. Like 100%. Then, what joy it is Baldrick. Me. <gasps> Hello. Greetings. Hey, Baldrick. Happy Friday the 13th. Now. <gasps> Hello, Shelly. How's it going? <laughs> so from here, going left will put me into like an endless loop like this. Up doesn't do anything. Down is also the endless loop slash putting me back where I started. So I have to do this. Gotsta. Seems like no matter what I do, it's always putting me killing the dude on the left first. What does the in-game hint say? I'm on the right track. Yeah, I figured so. Figured I had to kill the guy on the right first. Now, how do I do that?
Okay, let's let's back it up. Let's do this in reverse. So I can kill him from any of these three squares. Is there any way I can land in any of those squares? That the obstacles will let me land in them. <laughs> hey Jane, welcome back. I'm so close. I can feel it. I just need to figure out how to either land in in one of these. I need to land in one of these. I just need to figure that out. Um, if this guard wasn't here, it makes life so much easier. I can't land in this one, I don't think. It's approaching from here. I can't stop to land in this spot. Like, I can't do it from here either. So it can't be this square. This square is a no. Hmm, how do I do this? Yo, Sai, what's going on? You can? Oh boy. Alright, so I'm, there's something I'm not seeing then. Unless... Unless I somehow go up here. And then come in behind. This is the only block that's kind of stopping me to attack from behind here. Oh! 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 I see something. I see something. If I go here, like this, that's the answer. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. There it is. <laughs> Meditating Ash Lake on VR chat noise. Sounds awesome. Be like a pirate. <laughs> what did I miss? Death. Lots of death. All right, we're back into having only a few turns to do. Um, the X is right behind Jason. Just to his back right. Memento Mori, everyone. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Yeah, Ash Lake. I've heard of Ash Lake. It's awesome. Um, five turns to kill three guys. I am running out of turns. Ran out of turns. Try that again. Let's try that again. So I have five turns to do. And we need to end up in one of these squares. This one's probably out because it's too many moves to get there. Yeah, it's too many moves to even end up in this square. If I can even end up in this square. I don't think I can. So that one's out. This one is possible. This one could be possible. You need to do one, two, three, four, five. Nope. <laughs> Dean's back. Now it's working, Jane. Now it's working. That was scary. <laughs> that was scary. Um, we went one, two, three. But that's four, five, or four, five, six. So that's not working. That's not working. So, how do we do this? Um... One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's the path I want to take, but I don't have enough moves for it. Um, one, two, three, four. Five, six. No, that doesn't work either. <laughs> Stock is prey. Looking for the spot to kill. We're looking for it. We're gonna find it. We're gonna find it. 
We just need to find it in a more efficient manner. Just a little more efficiently. Um, hmm. This is a good one. This is a good one. I really want to do this. One, two, three. Because that kills both of those guys in three moves. I feel like for efficiency, that needs to be done. But then I only have two moves to get to this guy. And every move to get to him is three. One, two, three. One. No, too many that way. One, two, three. So it can't be the way I started. It has to be different. It has to be. But how do I do this efficiently then? I feel like the start is just so efficient that I don't want to ditch it. Good roll. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, you guys see it? Damn. All right. Give me a give me a few tries. So I was doing up left. If we get rid of up and we do down left. <laughs> unschooled bus with the raid. What is up? What is going on? Unschooled bus. <laughs> Love the name. How you doing? Not enough turns on that one either. So I'm always one out. Always one out. Just finish all eight chapters. This is nice. Yeah, we just started it like uh, an hour ago. Yeah, just about an hour ago. Having a good time with it though. It's very fun. Very fun. Appreciate the raid, man. Appreciate it. So, we need to back this up. I was close. Okay, yeah, we're gonna start out the same then. Now from here. If I go down, left, up, I run out of moves, because that's what I did last time. Down, down, left, up. If I go right, up, left, that's nope as well. Got some flaming Jason's game as well if you're interested in some, okay? Let me know. <laughs> hmm. Up left puts me out of position. I need to end in... Oops, wrong mouse. This square. I need to end there. And this is too many moves. This puts me out. This is too many moves. <laughs> Watching stream is my work. Not a bad job. Not a bad one. <laughs> yeah, up fails, down fails. Right fails. I think. Yeah, right's too many moves. Left, at least from here, is too many moves. This is the most challenging for me. It's best to work it from the beginning and work backwards. Like, figure out where you need to uh, end up. I think I need to end up here. There's been a few that I've been kind of stumped on. What does mum say? Let's see. Let's see what she says for hints. Kill the woman first, Jason, but do it from the left. Okay, I don't know how, what we did. Do it from the left. So go like this. Ah, oh, there we go. 
That, that, that solves it really easy. <laughs> that solves it really easy. <laughs> what the fuck? Let's go. My neighbor has installed a chicken coop. I am not in farmland. Maybe something with the way that the level was set up. <laughs> yeah, with that, with that hint, it makes it way, way easier. Um, so this one, I don't have a select set of moves. Um... The big thing is going to be getting this guy. So I need to figure out how I can end up in this chunk at the end. I think. All right, maybe not. No, that doesn't matter. I can always get back here from pretty much. Can I do it from anywhere? If I was in this bit. No, I don't want to get stuck in this loop. So this guy is going to be key to getting out of that loop, I think. Keep hearing chickens. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, it's in, in real life. I was like, wait, is this really to the game? <laughs> they installed a chicken coop. That sucks. That's very annoying. This girl can't do much. All good, Jane. All good. Some just don't help her very vague. Yeah, I saw one that was like, I already knew pretty much. It was like, attack someone. I killed a guy on the right first. I was like, I know I need to do that, but how? <laughs> that's that's like what didn't help. But it's uh, it's good to know like if you're on the right track or not. All right, so for this one, I want to kill, I want to say this guy last. At least I want to end up doing this kind of at the end, so I can end up in this place. So I need to end up here. I'm trying to figure out the pathing on this right now. Yeah. I'm just going to play around for a bit. Let's do, uh, let's start with down. So I can either do down or right off the bat. Um, both of those will end up either killing you. If I go down and then right, it'll kill this dude. But I need to kill this guy earlier, I think. So if I go, how do I get to him? That's the question. How do I, how do I kill this guy? Um, I need to... I'm just going to move around. This isn't going to be the solution. I don't think this will be the solution. That's what I need to do at the end. I need to do those moves at the end so it sets me up to kill here. So. How do I kill guy on the left? How does I do that? <laughs> What's the point of the prison? Uh, it's just different levels, so depending on kind of the stage that you're in, it'll change the environment. All right, Jane. So down gets me to kill you. If I go down, I have to force to go right, which kills this guy, which puts me in this square, which doesn't work for the end result. If I go right and then down, Puts me in that same kind of spot. Oh, they follow the movies. Ah, that makes sense. That makes sense. It's just this guy. You are the tricky one. That guy's the tricky one. So to kill him, I need to approach from either like somewhere in here. This spot is never going to happen. So it needs to be either a loop around like this. I think that is what I, I want to end up doing. I need to end doing here. But that's not going to happen, I don't think. Because that would work out nicely. So here would be good. 
Here would also be good. I think. No. If I ended up there, I can't get back into the loop. It just sends me into like a cycle. So. The guy on the left is definitely first. And that's probably what the hint is. Is probably to kill this guy first. I would guess. Down. Right. I wonder if there'd be anything with the scare experience. Brand, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Don't recall her being a prison. Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember either. Want to know who is first? Not yet. Still figuring it out. Still figuring it out. Poor chess experience. I'm okay on chess. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not great, though. <laughs> One thing I wasn't super savvy on was how uneven the puzzles were. What do you mean? What do you mean by uneven? Just getting into this spot that I'm having trouble with. I feel like I gotta kill you first. I wanna see what the hint says. Inmate at the bottom needs to die last. I, yeah. I figure that much. I figure I need to end up going boop, boop. Something like that. On school bus, thanks for the follow as well. Appreciate it. It's really challenging others is super obvious instead of them just slowly ramping up in difficulty. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. These last two have been kicking my ass. Yeah, I can get a slight hit. That's cool. Let's get a slight hit. I feel like it needs to be first, second, third. That needs to be the order of deaths. If that is wrong, let me know. If you guys know the answer. I think it's one, two, three. Just killing this dude. That's the only one that I'm figuring out. My order is off? Okay. That would change things then. You can move through a square after you kill someone. And that doesn't work. Yeah, that's going to happen with some puzzles. I think, yeah, depending on kind of how the mechanics and stuff are. People interpret stuff differently. That does make sense. All right, you go. Hey, what's up? Oh, you're back. Okay. <laughs> um, okay, so if my order is off. This guy's tricky as hell to get to. He has to be killed last for sure. But the question is. Maybe getting back into this, like ending here and then just zooming up. If I do this. Got it. That's all it is. All right, there we go. I just had to see that one spot. There we go. Beautiful. Alright, you did such a good job. Extra bloodlust. Fill me up, mama. Rank 7. What is your uh, position on the team, Brand? If you don't mind me asking. Awesome having you in here. We got a bronze here machete. I think I have two of these now. <coughs> Damn. I was like, oh, I can feel this coming. It's coming. <laughs> community, community. Awesome. Very nice. That's awesome. Uh, don't let them keep you locked up, Jason. You're not the one that belongs in that chair. Okay. 
All right. Where's the uh, X at? I just have to kill this guy. Okay. Let me uh, let me just try murdering stuff and see what happens. That puts me into death if I go left. Wait, unless I do this. That gets me kind of into a cycle. And this would get me killed if I went up. Yo, Cooley, what's up? How you doing, man? Alright, so that... Does not work. If... Now, going right right off the bat is probably not what I'm supposed to do. So I need to do something a little bit different. Here I'm stuck though. I can't go either of these directions. I can go back left. Like this. And now I can murder all the guys. How did I do this last time? How did I murder this guy? Go like this. Now it's just a matter of finding out how to get to this dude. So I'm not going to be able to stop in this square. Or that square. It has to be this square. So that means reverse operations. I need to end up here. Like that. Cool. Got it. Lockdown is done. We are on to Hot Tub Death Machine Winter Kills. Amazing. Yo, Kirby, how's it going? How are you? All right. Hot Tub Time Machine. Let's do it. Unlocked Frozen Jason. So, uh, I have one question. Is how do I change my skin? Like my Jason skin? How do I get back to this screen? Once I'm kind of out of it. <laughs> Say if I were to back out. So if I go back to the menu, where do I do it? It's not in settings, is it? No. When you play hit on the play episode, it automatically takes you to the Jason select. So I do play and then play. Oh, ah, I think last time I went to level select. So I go to play instead. Cool. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. All right, we're gonna try this frozen Jason. I like the uh, the change in skin tone based on frozen. He's all blue. It's cute. Crystal Lake Ski Resort to open. Oh no. <laughs> My kind of scary, cute scary. It's great. It's awesome. See those outhouses, Jason? You're a strong boy. I bet you can tip them right over. Ooh. That's a fun new mechanic. So we can tip over these uh these outhouses and turn them into stuff I can kind of move around. So I can tip it like in any direction. And it'll make like a two block. That's kind of cool. Oh, I want to do this. Get wrecked. <laughs> Skished. <laughs> cool if I drop a flaming Jason key in chat? Yeah, go for it. Definitely. Definitely. And splattered. Final is it like a skin? Is that what it is? Yeah, I'm totally cool with that. 
No worries. Oh, it's from the DLC, Jason. It's nice, nice. I'm not sure if I have those or not. I got the uh, DLC levels. I got codes for those. Yeah, if you want to drop a skin, feel free. Feel free. All right. Um. So. This appears super simple, but it's probably going to be more challenging. Getting to this chick. I only have one option for squares. So that means I need to be in this line somewhere. How do I do that? You show me my true form. All right, Sai, show it. Even a whole bunch of flaming Jason TV away, so fun times. Nice, that's awesome. Attack this dude here. I feel like getting back into killing this one's not the issue. It's you that's the issue. The only way I can end up in this row is by attacking this dude from this square. I think. Because if I were to just like attack him like normal. Wait, he moved there. Why did he move? Is it because I'm not facing him? I don't end up attacking. Interesting. Can I move him again? I can. Okay, I wasn't aware of that mechanic. That's cool, that's cool. I thought that, I thought that when you ended up beside someone, it was just a kill, but you have to be facing them for it to be a kill. Yeah, so that mechanic is what solved that one. Don't catch a cold, Jason. Mother will take care of you. Gotcha, Mom. Okay. That makes things a little bit different. If they have nowhere to run. So say, for example, if I end here, like if I slam down here, I wonder if that this person will run. Probably not. I think they get stuck. Yeah, I think the positioning is definitely going to be important. For sure. Um... The outhouse. I think the outhouse is key to this. It's gotta be. Or else it wouldn't be here. Yeah, I'm just gonna mess with this one for a second. Um, let's try this. She knocked the outhouse. Okay, ah. okay. Got it. Cool. Yeah, so that mechanic is like key right now. Final geek. Final geek. <laughs> we just switched up our weapons. We've been using the same weapon for a little bit. Well, the animations, I don't think they've repeated. Which is pretty cool. I'm going to switch it up. Let's see what we've got. Oh, wait, this is a new one. What is this? It's a ski pole. <laughs> the PG deaths are even more hilarious. Really? Are they like the same animations just without the blood or are they completely different? If they're completely different, I need to try some of those. What haven't we used? I don't know if I used the little dagger. This one. I don't know if I end up using this one. It's popcorn. I need to see that. I need to. We're testing this for science. <laughs> Must be tested. All right, so this outhouse is probably key again. I don't know if it needs to be tipped up or down yet. So I'm going to tip it up. 
Just to test. See what we end up with. Ah, I think that's the right answer. I think. Yeah, we do something like this. Um, I need her to move one more time. Like this. Alright, let's see this. Let's see this. <laughs> That's really cute. <laughs> That's really damn cute. Do such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra blood dust. Thanks, Mom. Ranking. Kite shield. I will equip that. Why can't all these nasty skiers and snowboarders just leave us alone? Okay. Um. So. Initially, I was just thinking go down, boom, scare this guy off, go up, or go to the left, and then go up, scare this guy off, but then it puts me out of position to kill this guy. So you're the tricky one here. If I kind of mix up the order... Okay, I can't do something like kill you first, or like, I could kill that guy first and do this. No, all right. So ending up, I'm just going to try some stuff. I'm just going to mess around. I'm going to try initially what I was thinking, which is scare these guys like that. Now, if I go like this, it's going to take me off the edge still. Right? Yeah. Okay. Reset. If I get you out of here first. That works. Maybe. I wasn't thinking about the X yet. I wasn't thinking about the X. Final six. This is the one that's going to mess me up. Because now I'm stuck in this. So it's this last one that's going to mess me up. The X I need to think about. I can kill everybody else. But the final. The final is the one that's tricky. Um, I don't know if any of this is scare related either. So I can get this dude on the left to run to the right by landing in this square. Either of you can kind of run off. Yeah, like the last one was pretty easy. This one is making me think a lot harder, though. This one's kind of tricky. Hmm. The order of operations is the thing I need to figure out. For, for this X, I can't get to it from up here, so it can't be this square. Thank you, stop. <laughs> I can't get to it from this side. I can't get it from this side. And I can only get to it if I were to use this guy. If we use this guy somehow, I think it might be possible. But I need to figure out how. Yeah, reverse. Reverse is really helpful, I think, on this on this one. So if I spook you to run over here. I wonder if that'll work. Let me try this. And just change the order that I'm doing things in now.
I don't want to rush into this one. I feel like I'm going to mess it up. That's definitely the way to start. I think. Um... Now it's a matter of the X. How do I make that happen? I could very easily go up and kill, but then I'm stuck. Yeah, I, I feel like we're good so far. I just gotta figure out this last chunk. If I do up or uh, left and then up, that scares you off. And then I'm stuck. So I can't do left. I could do down, right, up, left, no. Alright, again, think in reverse. Think in reverse. Um, I need to be approaching from either killing you final like this, but I don't think I'm going to get to this spot again because of that kill that just happened. Or somehow scare this guy to go down here if I ended up in this square. If I scared him to go down, I could go over from here. But I don't think I can go up right now. Hmm. I need to remember this is the spot that I'm going to uh, come back to. Uh, let's just move around a little bit and see kind of what's in front of us. Um, I can't I can't kill the one on the top, I don't think. It's going to put me into a weird loop unless I did that. But I feel like I just messed up. I don't feel like that's going to work. I don't feel like that's it. This will scare you off the edge. But then I'm stuck again. And this would kill you. And kill you. But then again, I'm stuck. I cannot get to her. So we gotta back it up again. Welcome back, slime. Welcome back. This part here is tricky. Hmm. Who <laughs> really likes candy corn? <laughs> I don't even know if I had candy corn. Wait, candy corn is like the, uh, I know what that is. Yeah, yeah, I know what that is. It's a, like a Halloween treat. It's like the little tiny, what are they? They're like orange and yellow and white, right? Looks like Lakeview Cabin. I bought those games. I haven't played them yet though. Those games look really sick. I think I bought like the entire series. I'm pretty sure. Have you played those Kulu? Yeah, that is the stuff. I thought so. I don't think I was a fan, if I remember correctly. Hey. Okay. Yeah, we're stuck again. We're stuck here, so it can't be that. Maybe I'm not good here. Let me see what Mama says. What does Mama say? Skier at the top is more disgusting than the others. Kill them last. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, so I already, I already figured that. I figured I need to kill them last because it gets me stuck in a loop. I need to end... Here. This is my last spot. And then I can go in for the kill. 
So I think maybe my order is messed up right now. Like this guy is in such a weird spot now. I can see you wanting to kill her right now and win. Hmm. You guys see it? Damn. Okay. Okay. It is killing her last though, right? It's definitely killing her last. And I think I need to end in this square. Let me know if that's uh that's correct. If I have to land in that square. Welcome back, Ichigo. How are you, man? I land that square last? Okay, cool. The thing is, if I do, if I go to her, I can't get to the guy. Let me show you. If I go to her, it puts me in a spot where I can't go here because I'm going whoop, right off. So I can't do it that way. Can't do it that way. Like this? And go back down. Ah, that works. So I don't need to end in that square. That's a different solution than the game is offering. Skier in the top is more disgusting than the others. Yeah, so that's a different solution. That's a different solution. Nice. Cool. That works. That works, though. Yeah, I didn't think of the reverse thing. Like, go up and then go back down. That's cool. That was really cool. Because every, every other direction, if I didn't go down after killing them, was sending me off the edge. Very cool. Very cool. <laughs> This is nice and warm in here, Jason. Yes, mom. All right. Um, so we can knock this bookshelf over, which is new. And I think it's a like particle effect. This looks really nice. Um, you're going to have to be last more than likely. Getting to you is kind of tricky. So... I want to see if this bookshelf thing moves. It does. Now getting to this chick is going to be really hard, if not impossible now. So I don't think I can do it that way. How do I manage that? Up, left. If I scare you, that gives me a place to move at least. Wait, 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 back it up one. one too far. She's one too far. <laughs> Let's see if this person like moves. They don't. There it is. Final there we go. Got it. <laughs> yeah, I do like the effect. It sounded like stars. You were saying it's like 
popcorn? It kind of looks like stars or something to me. Pop it out. We're going back to blood. I, I want the gore. I want to bring that gore back. Good idea with those bear traps, sweetie. Nasty snowboarders will be sorry. Oh, man. I can make them run into bear traps? This is awesome. All right. I want to switch this back after one of these. <laughs> it's so good. I love that there's a button for that. That's such a nice touch. <laughs> yeah, I heard that, Ichigo. I heard they're expanding it. Should be pretty cool. Okay. This. Oh. Oh, I need to make sure that you use the bear traps. I see. I was like, I can't get to you. There's a trap there. Final Susie. Final Susie. A little slice and dice. <laughs> Thanks, Gulu. Um, if I went up, I'm getting stuck. If I kill the guy on the right. Hey, who am I killing first? Where's the X at? Oh, the X is right on me. Damn it, Susie. <laughs> um, yeah, going up here gets me stuck because I would end up bear trapping no matter what. I end up, I end up getting trapped. Oh wait, like this. Get spooked. There it is. Got it. That's probably what you saw, slime. That's probably it. I'd imagine. I've been doing such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra bloodlust. Thank you. I think it gives me a crate now. That's not what you saw. Different. Could it still work, though? Possibly. The game is free to download on Steam, iOS, and Android, if you guys want to check it out. At least for the first uh, eight levels, I think. And there's some DLC on that on top of that. All right, we have two teapots now. I want to see if we can trade stuff in. I want to see how this works. Nine turns left. Okay, these are the ones that are really tricky when there's only a few turns. Um, how do we back out of this? I want to look at the uh, item stuff. Can I do that? Where do I do that from? Oh yeah, here. Bottom right. Bottom right. Um, yeah, so I have two of these. So that means I can recycle that if I wanted to. I don't have a bunch that I want to get rid of. It's just the one. I need more duplicates. I need to wait for more duplicates. Another flame adjacent skin. Feel free to grab it, guys. Yeah, it's the bottom right. Bottom right. It got it. Um, yeah, I don't have enough to trade in. I do. I do need to get three of them. Once we get three duplicates, then I'll trade some stuff. What do I want to use right now, though? I kind of want to try the ski pole again. I think I only got like one or two kills with it. Okay, nine turns, and there's two things to turn o turn over. I feel like I want to turn this one over. Like that. Flat. <laughs> okay, it doesn't turn over when you come at it from the side like that. This obviously isn't the solution, but I was just kind of figuring out if that worked. The, the mechanic of that worked. Machete and teapot so far? For, uh, stuff I haven't used or have used this i think i've used everything now we've slammed pretty hard with the teapot <laughs> we got a couple kills with machete i think ski pole is the one that we've got the least on i'm gonna try that one again you think you see it slap um oh we have two of let me cycle through these again uh, Two of these, and two of these. Yeah, 
So I need one more. If I can get one more duplicate, then I'll trade them in for something. I don't know how the trade-in thing works yet, so we'll have to check that out. Um. Okay. So for the X, again, always work backwards. I need end up in one of these spots. This one's probably not going to happen. I don't think, unless I do some crazy stuff with scaring. This one. Hmm. Yeah, that part, I'm not sure about yet. Nine turns. Do they do something like this? Final hipster. But then, how do I get to him? Somehow off of these crates, I think. Or no, down. I have to go down. Like that. One, two, three, four. Not enough moves. Not enough moves. To do it that way, at least. One, two, three, four. Can't do it. Uh, one, two, three. Nope. Can't do that way. I don't think it works that way. I don't think so. Let's reset it. Yeah, we're trying to do spoilers without spoilers. Not enough moves. Not enough moves. How are you doing, Zordon? So the key is trying to figure out a way to land in one of these squares. Dude, okay, get to here. Get to here. Um, can we spook one of these guys? Yeah, no problem. No problem. This one's tricky. This one's really tricky. I did like this idea of moving like that. But getting to the end. Yeah, I don't know if moves to go this way. Try it again. Try it again. Can I give a hint? Let me do the in-game hint first, just to see how, how vague of a hint it is. Crush that wretched skier on the top with a fridge and kill the other one with your own hands. Okay. So we need to crush this dude, which we can do by approaching like this. And they're saying to do this one with your own hands. So I could go back like this. Nah, there, there it is. That's the move. That's the move there. Yeah, if after the in-game hints, if I take an in-game hint and then I'm still puzzled, I will open it up to hints from you guys. Is that a hot tub? Yes, mom. <laughs> I always picture Jason talking in like this angsty teen voice. Yes, mom. <laughs> Gives you overthink. Definitely, definitely. Wait, do that one in seven moves? Can we, uh, can we look at that first? I want to see that. Let's go. I just want to back out and see that. It was, uh, kitchen counter, I think. What is it for, uh, seven moves? Let me know. Let's go. I think, uh, I think the devs might be interested too. I like it. It's free to play if you want to check out the first. I think it's like eight levels or something. It's a ton of levels. If you want to give it a shot, Zordon. So we do up, left, down, down, 
left, up, right. Very well played. Very well played. Nice, let's go. Very nice. Lurking, all right. Appreciate the lurk. Oh, that's what you were thinking as well, Zordon. That's what everyone was thinking. Wow. Apparently three people thought of it that way. That's cool. That's very cool. You guys are good at this shit. <laughs> Not to make a carrot to my backpack. That's funky. Oh, no. Rip. Um, getting to the X. That is interesting. Very interesting. How do I do that? Wait a sec. What if? did not work the way I thought it was. I thought this guy was going to get scared. But no, I didn't actually attack anybody, so it didn't work. Does this scare you? No. Hmm. I wonder... If I push this in, it prevents this dude from going into the drink. Which could be helpful. Um, I'm just gonna mess around for a sec. See if we can keep scaring these guys. Um, let's try killing this one and see if the other one runs. Save our carrots. <laughs> I was like, wait, what was that kill? <laughs> I didn't see a kill happen there. That's so funny. Um, all right, let's see if we can just keep scaring this guy. I don't know if I can end up behind them again. No, I can't. Okay, we need to back it up then. Okay. I think up to here, we're good. I feel like up to this point, it's like guaranteed good. Now, let's try instead going from this end. This will work. Maybe? No, not quite. Not quite. Not quite. That's close, though, I think. I feel like that's really close. Yeah, we're having fun. We're having fun. So for good from here. Um How do I get this guy? I need someone to end up here or here. No wait. If he ends up here, I can go from this side. We actually had it okay, I think. If we do it from this end, like this. Kill this guy. Scare this guy. Go back to this side. 
Then we're good. Got it. Got it. Final check. Beautiful. There it is. There it is. I knew it was close, but I was like, not thinking of the reverse. I was trying to think like too direct, you know? Okay. Holes. Love the cutscenes. It's so good. It's so good. Yeah, the cops are here now. Um, easiest thing, or like, first thing I'm going to try is just going this way. It's probably not the answer. <laughs> I haven't seen that yet. That's new. Do you get scared? You do? Okay. Can I get to you? I don't think so. Yeah, this one can't be get gotten to. There's no way to do this. So we need to back it up then. Probably all the way to the beginning, honestly. So getting to this last spot is the tricky bit. Getting over here. Because of where this hole is at. Uh, I do love was how far... How for some of them, you feel really dumb when it's obvious. We still feel good because you finished it. Yeah, no kidding. Definitely. Turns out they're expanding street party. I heard that. Yeah, heard that. You think you see it slime? Nice. Hopefully. Um... Getting here at the end. So I have only one option for how this ends. It's gotta get scared all the way to the side. Everything's even falling in the hole. <laughs> Some of these are getting pretty tricky. I wonder if any of this stuff will ever be used. Like going up here at all. Oh, you got it, Slime? Yeah, you played it before, boss. You've seen it. Did you do it all in one sitting or did you do it uh in like multiple multiple plays? So there's quite a lot of game for the the eight chapters. What is this like chapter three or four? I don't think I'm even like halfway through yet. There's a lot of puzzles. Um If I go left, it pushes me into the cop, so I can't start left. So it means I have to do this no matter what. Have to. Have to. All one sitting starting this morning. Nice. That's awesome. Very cool. So if we started here, I could like loop this way, which is different than what I did last no! time. Final girl. Got it. There it is. Process of elimination. Try one thing, doesn't work. Try something different. Got it. Feels like a cold stamp. Ooh. Did you think of a different way gaming? If you did, uh, feel free to put it in chat if it was like up, down, whatever. Up, down, left, right. <laughs> I'll go in, uh, I'll put it in for you.
But hey, okay, I just need to head out for now. Any questions about the game? Blue Wiz Discord Twitter is awesome. Sounds good. Appreciate it. Appreciate you being here. Thanks again. All right, let's go for this kill up here first. Like that. Hmm. Yeah, that's not going to work. They're part of the team. They do like the uh, community and QA. Yeah, so they're part of the team that made this. I think instead I need to scare you out. Into the trap. Pretty sure that's what I need to do there. Now getting to this bit. I feel like I'm... Wait. Totally good. <laughs> totally good. <laughs> nice little headshot. Top me up. Top me up. Rank 10. Let's go. Let's go. So you thought it was nice slime. We're on the same page. A kayak paddle, uh, equip, obviously. <laughs> I'm okay with them sometimes. Depends on the puzzle. Depends on the puzzle. I uh, hope you're bundled up nicely, Jason. You could catch your death of a cold. Okay. Let's start by pushing this over. And then kill the cop. Which will make you run. I'm going to make you run some more. I need you to run into a bear trap. Really badly. Nailed it. Nailed it. All right, we're done three. On to the fourth. <sighs> Happens if you miss the sequence for the final kill. Uh, I think I tried that once. I don't think it just, it just doesn't register, I think. You just have to nail it. I haven't tried Murder Marathon. It's amusing. What is that? Is that a, oh, is that a mode in here? Murder Marathon. I also don't know what Daily Death is. What are these? We take a quick break from these and check those out. Daily death. Complete a daily puzzle for bonus bloodlust. 13 day streak rewards a rare weapon. Huh. So you just have to like do a playback and playback every day. There's a lot to this game. Yeah, it's free to play um, for the first like eight. So I've done three of them. I'm on the fourth. The first eight are uh, unlocked for anybody. It's on iOS, Android, and Steam. And then I think the last four are DLCs that there's like other DLC stuff in this game. Yeah, this is a daily puzzle murder marathon. I won't spoil. Oh, so they give you a brand new puzzle every day. That's kind of cool. It's probably going to be really hard. Zombie Jason. I'll take it. Oh, this is really cool. I like the style of this. These ones are probably going to be pretty tricky, I think. I don't know what's up with the button. I'm not going to spoil anything. I feel like some of these mechanics aren't uh, present in my game yet. Like this button thing, I don't know what this does yet. I don't want to spoil anything. We're going to ramp up to that. <laughs> Nyx, what's going on? <laughs> Happy Friday the 13th. Murder Marathon. Let's look at this too. How many kills in a row can you get? Ooh. 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 Uh. 
Oh my god, it's literally just the skill checks. <laughs> Nothing but skill checks. I'm mean, gonna get tighter though. That's a cattail. Hey Fiona. I missed it! I missed! Super mega kill combo! This is pretty cool. The music's great. It's great. Sunshine in my face, so time to get off the bed. Sounds good, Nick. Good morning. I need to try this again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Theo's distracted. As always. Sunset's birthday being Friday the 13th. Nice. That's cool. That's very cool. How old is he now? Did it change weapons or is it the same weapon every time? That was his hands. Yeah, it changes. It changes it up. This is great. It's good Dead by Daylight practice. These tunes. Just hit three months today. Awesome, man. Grats. Doing well, Nick. Doing well. Good to see you. Woo! These are getting tight now. These are getting really tight. Oh, well, that's a big kill zone. Do it to blow off some steam if you're getting stuck on some puzzles. <laughs> oh boy. That one's hard. That one's hard. Ultra intense bloody kill combo. Yeah, doing well next. Doing well. Hope you are as well. Weapons user pull from your unlocked weapons. That makes perfect sense. That makes perfect sense. What are the achievements like for this? Oh, you rank up on this stuff too? Cool. So you get crates out of it. That's nice. A kite shield? I think I have two of these. I'm gonna do some uh, exchanging. Let me see if there's an uh, achievement for this thing. I wanna see how far we have to get. Twenty, thirty. 30 consecutive kills in murder marathon. I think that's the big one. You have to make it to 30. We made it to 14. <laughs> Are feeling better after cold? Damn, what a big weather. No kidding. Yeah, it's all over the place. Yeah, kill a thousand total the highest combo is 30. I want to do it, man. I want to do it. We will. Give me two minutes. I'm going to be right back. I'm just going to run to the bathroom real quick. And then we're going to jump into this. I'm going to see if I can get 30. If I fail like five times, then we'll jump back into the puzzles. But this is a fun way to kind of like break it up, mix it up a little bit. Give me two minutes, guys. Be right back. All right. I am back. I am back. Let's do this. Back into the murder marathon. <laughs> All right, Cooley. Have a good one, man. Have a good one. This music is awesome. This music is awesome. Let's do it. Hope you feel better, Nyx. Really do. Yeah, we're at three. I wish there was a counter. Four. Five. Six. Best was 33. You got it. You got it. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. 13. These are just really getting tricky. Ooh, that's close. 14. 
15. 16. 17. 18. Fuck! 18. Jeez Louise, Blam Omega Wamo kill combo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game. This game makes me laugh a lot. I love it. It's close though. 18, not bad. 18 is not bad. Kill streaks? Kind of, yeah. Essentially, you try and kill as many as you can in uh, an order to build up like, a kill streak. And there's an achievement if you hit 10, 20, and 30, I think. And it gets us new weapons, which I'm down. I want to swap out the weapons. I want to do that first. I want to look at this real quick. We'll, we'll have to watch that again, I think. I just wanted to look at swapping my weapons out. Um, there's a few I can swap now. There we go. Let's see what this trade does. So I'm doing three bronzes. Let's see what we get out of it. Another bronze, but something I didn't have yet. Some shears. Cool. Alright, at least we got something new out of it. That's cool. I wanna go back to this murder marathon, though. I wanna- I wanna get this. 18 is our best so far. We gotta get to 30. One. Mom kinda looks like Chucky's bride a little bit, yeah. Two. It'd be nice if there was a counter. That is one suggestion I would add for this. In these tunes. Nailed it with the tunes. And it's four? Pretty sure. Four? Five? Boom! <laughs> Six? Seven? Eight? Nine. Ten. Lyrics fit too, really? I'm not listening close enough. Damn it. <laughs> Gotta run time for work, have a great stream. Alright, Shadow, have a good one. Catch you later. Well, that one sucked. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> He's very, very cold. I don't know why this is so satisfying, just watching all the different kill animations. Alright, I'm not counting, I'm just gonna play it. We'll see how far we can get. I'm just not gonna count it this time. gonna focus up. Boom, that slam. I'd be so sad if I mess up on one of the big ones. No! I should have waited. Should have waited. Should have waited. So is that 12 inches of snow? What? We had snow a little bit yesterday, but not that much. Not even close. I thought every game frustrated with some puzzles. Definitely. Definitely. This is like wackier series. Flash game where you choose your weapon. Yeah, yeah. Kind of. Kind of same idea. Another sickle. Oh. Alright, best streak is still 18. I think we can do it. I think it's doable. I mean, unschooled bus says he's got 33. So it's definitely doable. Yeah, I'm gonna try not counting it though. 
The way it bounces at the outside, the speed of it is interesting. I'm just gonna wait for it to like ramp in every time. I'll definitely miss less of them then. Ooh, that was close. Ooh, that was tricky. It's hard when they're super small like that. Nice easy one. Then they're gonna come in with the big, the really small ones. Oh yes. Close. <laughs> oh shit. Fuck, oh, they get hard. 20! That's an achievement though, right? Yep, grindhouse. Alright, we're gonna come back to this. We got to 20 though. That's not bad. Not bad. Top me up. <laughs> Try not to have a chance to start with you. It's all good, Nix. It's all good. Alright, we've got another one of these too. We might be able to swap for another item. That's fun though. That is good stuff. Um, wait, tap to unmask? Wait, what was that? Oh my god, you can unmask Jason when you have him unlocked? That's awesome! That is a great touch. I love that. Got to 20. 20 is not bad. 30 is the highest achievement we need. And kill a thousand, which we're not even close. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's not the best look. There's a reason he's got a mask on. It's that's a nice touch though. That's definitely a nice touch being able to take him on and off. Or uh take him off and put him on. Zombie Jason. Moist. Smelly. Deadly. <laughs> so that's a mechanic later on in the puzzle? That would be neat. If you had to like take it off mid mid game or something that'd be kind of cool wait is there more that are locked now there wasn't this many before oh it's the uh oh i see there's a ton of different jason costumes let me see what these other ones are aqua jason funland jason apocalypse jason uber jason that is dope i need to get that Baghead Jason is unlocked. I think this is a these are some DLC ones. Ripper Jason. Jack ain't got Jack on Jason. <laughs> Medieval Jason. That's cool too. The once and future king of killing. Love it. Caveman Jason. One million BC. Good year for terror. <laughs> wow. They, they put some work into this. I love it. Love it. This is 0 0.008 percentile of that yet. <laughs> so these are some other ones that I don't have yet. Flaming Jason, that was the one that uh, someone put a code in chat for earlier. I think Unschooled was putting codes for this skin in. Yeah, so these are all DLCs, in-app purchases. Bloodbath Jason. It's pretty cool. Oh man. Is this the one that's all like purple and green? I love that look. The like retro one? I wonder what this one looks like in color. Like when you can actually see it. So have another one just holding it for something? Makes sense. Makes sense. <laughs> Jason's lit as fuck. I didn't even see that Nick. So then I was like, wait, what is Nick's re reply to? That's great. Jason's lit AF. That's dope. Alright, let's go back to... 
Actually, I kind of want to grab one of these DLC ones that I have here. Baghead's cool. I'm going for Medieval. Medieval looks ridiculous. I love it. <laughs> Crystal Lake Alumni Cruise. We're on a cruise ship. We're on a boat. All right, Nix. Sounds good. Oh, shit. He's coming in. <laughs> Open ocean. Bringing phones will distract those nasty people, Jason. Dial them up. Okay. So if I hit the phones... Boop. Oh, I called one. Ah, uh, I dialed this phone. It called the other phone. And it brought him over to it. That's kind of neat. That's kind of cool. Gotcha, bitch. So if I miss, I wanted to actually test that. If you miss, you got to redo the level. Now we know. I hadn't missed one yet. That was my first one. Oh, no. You don't have to redo the level. You just don't get as much blood for it. Your meter doesn't go up. That's what it is. So you don't unlock new weapons, essentially, if you uh, if you miss. Is the ship moving? I get terribly seasick, you know, Jason. Sorry, Mom. Interesting. What if I trigger this one? Oh, they have to be in line with it. I see. Get you out of here. No. Um. I mean, I can murder you here, but it's not going to help me in the long run. I think the order needs to change up. Unless I do that. Aha. Got it. There it is. Boop. 33 and up, they keep ramping up the mechanics. Yeah, it seems like they're adding new and new stuff. Every chapter is introducing something new. I wonder if, like, literally every single one's gonna add something. That'd be pretty crazy. Just like the way you kind of combo things together. When do we get to New York? Seems like we've been on this boat forever. I have to do left. If I do up, it puts me in the cop on the left's crosshairs. If I do right, it puts me in the cop on the right's crosshairs. So I need to do left and then up. For sure. I can kill you, get you out of the way. Now, moving this chick around is something I think I need to do. I feel like I have to do that. I don't know why, but I feel like I do. If I could get her to go out this way and then like down here. I don't think I can, though. I might be able to somehow. No, that's just going to kill her. That's just going to kill her. Let's back it up a little bit. Okay, before I kill the cop. Ah, wait. If I do this. And then that. Got it. Final nerd. There it is. 
There it is. Got it. You got two sword on? Beautiful. Good to hear. Are we there yet? <laughs> Fuck off, mom. <laughs> All right, um, I can move you. Wait, not yet. No matter what, I gotta do this. But then I'm gonna move up again. Okay, that doesn't work, but I can ring you to go over here. Why? I don't know, but I'm gonna try it. Now everybody's in a weird spot. But it's a weird spot that works. I'm gonna get you, lady. I'm always getting moody. No kidding. No kidding. Peer pressure. Nice pun. Oh, is this New York? It smells funny. Or is that you, Jason? Sorry, Mom. Alright, um, I can use the phone to ring the girl on the top down. Or I can use this phone to ring this dude to the right. Maybe I need to do both. No, I can't do both. Both cannot be done yet. Unless I do that. And then we murder your face. But then... We're not set up for the uh, for the X. Let's reset this completely. Just wake up a bit ago. Uh, up all night working on my emoticons. Finally finished. Got three sub buttons. Nice. That's awesome. Got your emotes submitted. That's dope, dude. Good morning. <laughs> all right. Um, how do I get someone to stand so I can be in one of these spots? I need someone to stand here in one of these like beige colored ones. How do I make that happen? I think I think that's what I'm supposed to do. By phone, you can come down. This one's kind of tricky. Hmm. Or alternatively, I can scare you. Ask mom. Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. If I get super stuck, I will. It brings both of them here. Now. I like her positioning. Because then I can get this final kill pretty easily. Just dealing with this dude then. I feel like that scare to the phone is good. Him though, I don't like. So I'm going to try resetting that. I'll see if I can get him in a better spot. I, I want to see if that's possible. To move him. Um, no matter what, he's going to the phone if I dial the other phone. If I dial this phone, she moves, but I liked where she was, so I don't want to do that. I do like this setup a lot. Yeah, dealing with this guy. That's the issue. Let's reset it again. I want to see what mom says, what her hint is. See how close I am. Mommy wants you to ring the phone on the right first, but maybe go the long way around it. Ring the phone on the right first. Which is what we're doing. We're making the right one ring. But what if we went like this way? No, I don't want to spook her into a corner like that. 
Ah, I don't want that either. Yeah, let's reset all the way to the beginning. I'm just gonna spam R instead. Just reset stuff rather than doing the uh, T thing. And that's not audio borks. The audio borks will Okay. Hmm. I really like putting her there. And then ringing the phone, but yeah, it puts him in a bad spot. How do I deal with this guy? Look, that sets me up for a kill on the X. But I have no way of killing this dude. Just spam that out. Yeah, it borks the audio if you uh, hit R a bunch of times. So I need to, I need to fix that, I think. Hmm, this dude. This dude. Do you guys see a way to kill him? I'm only going to take a hint on this one. A way to kill this guy. That's still going to set me up. Because I can see something like this killing him. Maybe? No, that doesn't even kill him. Yeah, because the phone moves the, moves the girl. The phone didn't move it. Green the right phone means calling the right. Trying those to the left phone. Maybe. Maybe they mean doing this instead. I'm not too worried about the hints, so we can always uh, try and find other ways. Because there's multiple, multiple options. Ring the other phone. Okay. <gasps> it's Para. <laughs> Para. What's good, Para? How's it going, dude? <laughs> So this is how I started out. This was the, the way I started this. But the issue... Oh, wait a minute. I can cycle her to the other phone, but is that good for me? I can do this. And that'll line me up to kill the guy. And then maybe I can, like, kite her around with the phone somehow? No, I don't think so. Ooh, I didn't expect that. I did not expect that. How do I get him to move? I need this guy to move again. <laughs> What's up here? Now you're golden? Fuck, I'm not seeing it. Um... But if we kill him, how do we get the guy on the X? Oh, yeah, this way. That way. I was trying to think too direct. You gotta go for, like, weird routes. Yeah, 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 got it, got it. There it is. Boop. Yeah, happy Friday the 13th, pair. Hope you're having a great day, man. You're doing such a good job, sweetie. Here's some extra bloodlust. Thanks, mom. <laughs> I always went borked. My brain always borks on puzzles. Always. A pool cue. I'll take that. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Is that a kitty? Don't hurt the kitty. Oh. <gasps> Welcome. <laughs> Got that bork. Getting our bork on. Another good example of uneven puzzle difficulty. Uh, yeah, that one was kind of tricky. At least for me, it was. 
Need good vibes yesterday? Yeah. Send them your way, pair. Definitely. Definitely. Welcome to Kitten Hell. How can hell... How can it be hell with kittens? How can it be hell with kittens? It can't be. It's a good fucking cat. <laughs> Alright. Alright, cat. Let's see. Let's see what this is all about. So, does the cat get spooked? Is our first thing we gotta figure out. Oh, the cat gets real spooked. Cat gets real spooked. Now I can't go up. It means I have to go right, and then up, and then left, and then spook the kitten again. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> I didn't see that fire there. Oh, that was good. That was good. So this is the big apple. Doesn't seem that impressive. Eight turns left. These are the tricky ones. When you only have a certain number of turns. I forgot about the phones. I forgot about the phones completely. No! Not, enough. Not enough. Not enough. <laughs> I didn't see her face. I didn't see her face. I believe you though. Okay, I think the phones are going to be key to this. So ringing the phone on the right will bring the girl down. Fastest way to do that would be like this. <laughs> Running out of turns. Yeah, can't be done. Reset it. Yeah, she keeps changing. Her facial expression changes. <laughs> it's all over the place. <laughs> Alright, um... Hmm. This is a tricky puzzle. Not enough turns. Not even close. Alright. Let's work this backwards. Let's work this backwards. I need to end up in one of these rows. Somewhere. And I can only do that if I hit either here. I have to end up somewhere in this line. Or I bounce off this guy. Which if I move this way, he runs, so it's not going to work. Literally no room for error. Yeah, these ones are tricky. These ones are really tricky. They have to be done perfectly. So there was one example of one earlier that I think gave us like nine turns and let's go solve it with seven, which is kind of cool. Kind of cool to see multiple solutions for some of these. Now, the phones. I feel like the phones are the key to this one. No! Now, the problem is he moved down a spot. 
If he didn't move down a spot, that would have worked out. I would have been able to go one no! and two. Ah! And that would have worked. But he moved. So that messes it up. If I can do the same thing, but that actually requires an extra move. Yeah, I can't get over to that phone without taking an extra move. Unless... Let's try this. Yeah, it's not lining up, not lining me up right. Too many moves. Too many moves. I think I'm on the right track. So something like that. And then how could I shorten this? It'd be up, left, down. We'd get a kill on her. Up, left, down. But then I can't finish everything here. I do think it's kind of close. Kill the guy? <laughs> but then I have even less turns, I think. Yeah, that won't work. Get both of your phones. Hmm. Stopper sees it. I'll try what you're thinking, Dark. So it's scare guy. No! Ring phone. And then I can't kill the guy. Unless I move back. Kill the guy. All the way over here. Kill the girl. But then we're out of turns. I want to see what mom says. Mommy wants you to call that dirty New Yorker and lure him down. Dirty New Yorker. Probably this one, right? I think. That's a dark, or it's what you're thinking too, Zordon? Okay, so this one's trickier than uh, some of the others. Um, I need to end up either sliding into this and then down, or sliding to him and then down. Or in here and down. Just a matter of efficiency. Lower, lower phone, if you call the lower phone, it'll lure, like, the way the phone works is anyone that's in line with it, like, not diagonals or anything, it'll, uh, go in a straight line. So check, if I do this one, it's gonna go left and right, and it's gonna go straight up all the way to her. You'll see the lines come out? That's the way the phone kind of idea works. And if we tried getting to the lower phone... I don't even know if it's possible. Yeah, like this. It'll lure. You can see how it works off that one. How that like functions. So we got to reset that again. I'm pretty sure I need to dial on the right phone to make the bottom one ring or the one on the left ring. Just finish eating. I like the charm of these graphics. It's very cute. It's very cute. 
It's free to download on your phone too if you want to check it out. I feel... Wait, what if I do this? Bring it that way? And then kill here. Nah, it's too many turns. Way too many turns. Way too many. Hmm. Way too many. Mom said she wants me to call the New Yorker or something like that. Why don't you call that dirty New Yorker and lure him down? But that's a girl. But this is down, right? Like if we look at it this way, I don't know if they mean to lure this one down or to somehow lure this one. Yes, it's a matter of luring this guy, right? Yeah, that's what it sounds like. So I need him to be in line with this phone like this or this phone like that. Getting that to happen is tricky. <laughs> Hmm. This one's puzzling. I don't know how to lure him. It would have to be with scare tactics. Right? But how do I lure the guy? I can kill the girl, no problem, but how do I actually lure him? That's the question. And where would I want to put him? And like, why? Well, with the X, I want to... Uh, another enemy is going to spawn here. Yeah, I'll take a hint, Snopper. I'll take a hint. Yeah. Because what happens with the X is this turns into a final kill that I have to get. So I need to be in line, like in this row or this row, to get that final kill. So I need something to bounce off of. Like either him, which is kind of what I was thinking. He's like, if he stays there, I can bounce into him and then take it out. Mom is wrong, you're gonna lure the girl. I thought so. I thought so. Yeah, pretty sure I was luring this person. Because luring this guy would take a lot of work to get him in position to be able to lure him. And I kind of want to keep him where he's at, honestly. So if we lure the girl, it'd be like this. Or I could scare the dude and then lure the girl. So that took off a few moves. Now it's a matter of dealing with this. It's either I scare the dude at the corner or I lure her like this. Nice that you go. That's awesome. What is it? Five turns left. Yeah, download it, man. It's awesome. It's awesome. So I have two options. Let's reset it. I have two options for luring the girl. I can either do right, <gasps> up, left, which scares the guy, or alternatively, 
I do left, up, right, which lures her without scaring the guy. And the question is, which one is it? And how do I kill this dude? How do I get in position to kill this guy? Oh, you remember this one, the boss? <laughs> May 11th? Cool. Sounds good. Sounds good. Do you know where it's at? At PvP again? Cool. I'm in. You're saying go up and kill the girl first? <laughs> then dude, then win. So to go up to kill her, I would have to do this. No, that's an extra move to kill her like that. I can do it more efficiently, I think. There might be a more efficient way to kill her. Lure her down, then kill her. Okay, thought so. So lure her. Kill her, I can do... Up, left, down. Ah, there it is. I was going the opposite direction. There it is. That's it. So we were really close. We were really close. It was just changing directions. This is what we need to do. Got it. Got it. Oh no, not the cats. Jason, remember not to hurt the kitties. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, always the kittens, man. Kittens are going to mess us up. So, either the cops are free game right off the bat. Um, the outhouse. I feel like I want to tip this first. I feel like I want that in a better spot. Oh, oh my god, it's Jason Bourne! <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's Jason Bourne. <laughs> Where's the X on this one? Oh, it's behind, behind the cop. That's not going to work then. I need to uh, take a step back, scare the kitty. This is not going to work. Final oh, wait. Maybe? No. No. Cats are blocking me. The cats are blocking me hard. Um. I wish I could murder this cop right off the bat. It's all about these cats right now. Hmm. I need to end up here. So I can scare the cat back. Without killing this cop though. And then do like this. But that still fucks me up. Because I run into the cat again. Or the, if the cat was back I would run out. How do I kill this cop? That's what I need to figure out. How do I kill this cop? Without fucking up the cats. If I scare this dude... Maybe. Maybe there's a way. This one's tricky. Yeah, I did think I had to scare both kitties back. Yeah, that's like pretty much 100% so I can actually attack the cop. <laughs> Okay, this one's tricky. Same thing, kill the other cop and the person. Yeah, it's the order of operations is what I need to figure out. 
Let's say I get both cats back. How does this last interaction go? How do I get in here and kill this person? I need to figure that bit out. We got a cat of our own. Cat is back. <laughs> Hmm. Yo, Leech, what's going on? Use the left cat to stop you after you kill the cop. Uh, the cats will get... I can't touch the cats. I can't touch the cats at all. Jason sees animals, just walk away from the puzzle. <laughs> just, just walk away. Just, just walk away. <laughs> The scaring is definitely key on this one. <laughs> the outhouse I'm not sure about though. You trigger a cat so I see what they do. It's literally just if you stand stand beside it, um, it'll run just like a person does. But if you walk into it, it's GG. I'll show you real quick. See, the cat will back up if you go close to it. But if you walk into it, animal cruelty. So that doesn't work. So I backed one cat up. I'm not sure if it's the first one I should do or not. <laughs> These cats are jerks. This is different. That is useful. That is useful. That right there is what I need for the end. 100% that's what I need for the end. <coughs> Got it. <coughs> Got it. Final geek. Got it. Nailed it! The tricky thing was figuring out the ending on that one. If you could figure out how the ending worked, like the ending kill interaction, then the puzzle was solved. I'll take credit for that. Okay. <laughs> Alright, back to the phone bullshit. Oh my god, this cat's so cute. <laughs> So, phone interactions. I wonder what happens if I do that. Uh, wait, no, never mind. I was trying to think if you could like ring a phone and have someone walk into you as you're ringing it. I don't think that's gonna ever happen. No, that's not possible. Um. All right. So from the end again. So if I call this one, that dude's gonna run down. Murder your face. <laughs> I don't know, Doug. I don't know. <laughs> hmm. So that puts me in a loop that I can't get out of. So that's obviously not the answer. If I ring this phone to move him first. Damn. <laughs> <Rip. laughs> Got to fuck up the counselors. Got to get back. For what they did to you. Oh, I didn't even see the porta potty. That's what I need to do. 100%. I didn't even see the porta potty. I wasn't even looking at it. 
So I can knock it over to the left or to the right. Though so getting in position for it, that's tricky. If I call this dude over, kill him, and then I can knock the porta potty. Does that help me in any way? No. Not knocking it that way at least. If I can find a way to knock it the other direction. How would I do that? I need to end up in this spot somehow. Which I could do by doing that. Not quite. Nope. Never mind. Damn. It makes me think. How can I knock it to the left? <laughs> Cute. Cute. Got him. I don't think I've tried this out yet. I'm gonna try this paddle. Let me do some paddling. What does mom say actually for hints? What's she got? Try knocking over that outhouse, Jason. Maybe they won't hear the phone ring. Okay, so we do have to do that 100%. Now, how? Got an idea? Maybe. No. No. Back to the beginning. Fix the audio. I was trying to think maybe there was a way I could bounce it off of this dude. Like have him go over here and then scare him down and then chase him and knock over the porta potty. But when I do that, it puts me in line to hit this other bone. So it can't be like that. This one's tricky. I feel like it's gonna be something scare related now too. How do I knock this porta potty? What was her hint again exactly? It was porta potty related. Yeah, make it so the f they don't hear the phone ring. Yeah, so it definitely has to be tipped into this position. Hmm. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. I'll take a hint on this one because I'm getting pretty stumped. I need to end up in this line. Without ringing this phone. So this is where we start. Thanks, bus.
Hmm. We go up. Doesn't work. I don't think. Left. No. Right. Please stop it. It's got to be something scare related. I feel like it has to be. Because just the phones and moving is not getting me into this area. I feel like I need to scare this dude over and then like push him down or something. I don't even know if that would work. So something you too, Stomper? This one's tricky. This one's really tricky. It looks simple, but getting the, the loop to not happen is tricky. Just this. Dealing with this. You think Mon lies? Alright, what do you think is the, the answer, Pear? Use like uh, up, down, left, right. We got the phone cancel thing. Trying to scare the person down. What would you put in for like up, down, left, right kind of thing? What would you try? I'll punch it in and see what happens. Right. Up. Left. And then I love this music. So good. The prophet. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this one's stumping everybody. How do I push that fucking thing? It's the like the combination of the phones and their positioning is just fucking it, man. Yeah, it's it's 100% the upper guy. Like I need to get him in a good position. I need to position him better. It's like the interaction between the porta potty and this dude. So you're saying do this? This is what I was trying earlier. No! Like spooking him. And how do I spook him into a better position? Oh, wait. That's it, 100%. There it is. There we go. Yeah, that works. That works. I didn't see the porta potty line up there for a sec. Yeah, that works. That works. I was on the right track then with uh, trying to scare that other dude. I thought it was a scare thing. Just exactly how it lined up. It was stumping me on that one. Top me up. Rank 16, let's go. Some really good puzzles in here, man. I don't know if I'm gonna do too many more. Uh, kill with a tome? Sure. I don't know if I'm gonna do too many more. My brain's starting to shut down on some of these. We're trying, though. We're gonna keep trying. Um, More of this phone stuff. This is gonna be a lot like the last one, I think. All right, so right now the phones aren't affecting anybody. Can we get a different view? So phones are having no effect right now.
if I were to go here, both of those will get scared into phone areas. And then... Oh, wait. I didn't see the X. No, we're good. We're good. I think. Not quite. We're close. We are close. That is definitely the idea. But I don't like where he's positioned right now. He needs to be up a couple squares. Or... If I can get to the other phone. Which I can't. Not from here, at least. Okay, so that's, that's starting position. Right there. I do like the scaring them out to the sides thing. That works decently. I feel like I have to start with that. Ah, good idea. Yeah, hit this phone here. Rather than from the way I was thinking initially. And then... Wait. This phone first. Then this phone. Then down here. Murder. Murder. Kill them all. That's the way to do it. There we go. I had it backwards. I had it backwards which phone we hit first. Very nice. There we go. Return to the harbor. 11 to 13. Let's see if we can finish these ones out. I think we've seen enough Jason back to the ship. Okay, so this one's going to be very scare related. I can start with either an up or a right. Both of the other ones take me off of the ship. So, game being the way it is, I'm not going to start with right, I'm going to start with up. Like that. <laughs> My brain hurts, need more sodium this game provides. Dude, you need to see this other mode, it's pretty fun. I'll show it to you in a sec. How do I not go off the side? That's the issue. Back it up one step. If I back up, or if I go left, it's going to take me off. If I go down, left, up, it's going to take me off. So I can only go up. I have to do that, if, at least from this positioning. Let's see what happens here. I'm going to kill you with knowledge. <laughs> and I can't kite this dude around the entire way, can I? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here it is. Got it. Now that. There it is. Boop. <laughs> nice. Easy. Yeah, that was not too bad. That was not too bad. Overthinking it. We'll kill you. Hope we're headed someplace warm. Me too. Um, so this should be the last one. We got a kitty. And the kitty doesn't want to go in that hole. There's a big hole for that kitty. I don't want to put it in there. I wonder if the cat gets attracted to the phone. Probably not. I want to test. No. Um, if... I don't even really puzzle. I don't even think about it. This is what I ended up with. Is there a way to get over there? Nope. Nope. Ah, you're right. Cover the hole. I do that. Definitely, definitely. Let's... I wonder if I cover the phone, too. If I block the phone, I wonder if that does something as well. I can block the hole. Then we go for Murderfest. 
There's got to be something with this, too. I have to move through here at some point. Like this, whatever I just did has got to be wrong. Just because of the way that the level's designed. It has to be different than that. All right, we're going to finish this one. We have to. I will it. This is definitely an interaction right there that has to happen. That has to happen based on the way the level's made. It's gotta. Can I get the shelf over killing the person on the phone? Yes, you can, yeah. Yeah. Like this. Flat. But then the question is, how do I get to this last chick? So I get stuck in a loop. That's where it gets tricky. Does this cat get spooked the way I want it to? It would go in the hole, right? If I do this? No, it doesn't. It tries backing up. It doesn't go to the left. Or to the right, I mean. I should probably think about this more rather than just trying to like brood it. Just like the order that I do things, I'm not sure about yet. I like the way that that all moved together, but it still doesn't set me up to get in there, I don't think. Hmm. Did you just shove to kill the chick? I feel like it's probably more to block the phone because of where it's set up. It does if you do it right? The person can only go to the top phone if I ring the other phone. So it's like you're calling them. Is it solvable from here, boss? No? Okay. Hmm. Your shelf on left phone only on the whole call a person up. How do I get in that position though? Like I can do this to block the hole. And then it pushed me into that position, so that's a no. How would I even get to this phone? Like I don't know if I don't think there's a way to get to this phone at all. I gotta think about like backwards again. I think like solving it from the end forwards is the best way to do this. Scare up if you go down? No, because you run past her like this. You can scare the cat, but you can't scare her. 
because apparently you're moving so fast. I, I know you're going to have to block this and move the cat back by landing in this X, probably. <laughs> yeah, Fiona's, Fiona's run, out, run away. I don't know what she's doing now. Are we getting some food or something? Imagine being chased by a psycho killer who moves super fast, but only in straight lines. Both terrifying and hilarious. True. True. <laughs> How you doing, Baldrick? This puzzle, man. There's so many variables to play with. Did I, did I see what mom said yet? I don't think so. Mommy thinks you could spook that cat out of the way with something loud and obnoxious. Make sure it's safe first. So I need to put this down to make it safe. And I need to scare the cat with something loud and obnoxious. Let's go. Okay. Good. Being a bit distracted by stuff. So mostly looking. All good, man. Appreciate it. Wow. Good rolls. Very nice. Very nice. So loud and obnoxious. Can the cat get scared by another person? That we haven't seen yet. Oops. So I know that needs to be blocked. It's... Damn it. Yeah, that's not the answer. There's no way. There's no way. Killing that person on the top right off the bat messes me up. If I do this... And don't ring the phone. This puts me in line for another kill. But not in line with this final solution. Or does it? Oh, the cat doesn't get scared to the side. Oh, it's so close. So close. Close but no cigar. I don't know about the loud and obnoxious thing. I'm not sure where that bit comes in. And I feel like the person that's on the top is not like doing enough. I think there's something special with them. Phone lures the cat, really? I've never seen the cat interact with the phones before. It's always like ignored it. But maybe if there's if this other person wasn't in the way. Yeah, I'm blanking, man. I'm completely blanking on this one. Final hmm. Yeah, that's not it either. How do I move this fucking cat? <laughs> that look on her face. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> yeah, the left bookshelf's a weird one too, yeah.
I feel like the left bookshelf has to be used to block the phone, and the other bookshelf needs to be used to block the hole. But the game could just be fucking with us. It's probably the wrong order. That still fucks me up. I don't know, man. This one's tricky. Really, really tricky. How do I move this fucking cat? <laughs> That's my big question right now. <laughs> Just leave some food. Fuck, man. <laughs> this is insane. Alright, hit me one more time. It spooked that cat out of the way with something loud and obnoxious. Make sure it's safe first. I can't, Rumpel. I can't. <laughs> if I kill the cat, it's GG. It can't be done. Fucking hell. Um. I will subscribe unsubscribe for any cat killing. <laughs> phone scares it? I don't think it does. I, like if I hit the phone or if I make the phone ring, the person will come to it, but the cat doesn't give a shit at all. Not great bookcase after scaring top lady. Yeah, I'm willing to take all the hints on this one. Because now I'm uh I'm all fucked up. Don't kill top lady until you cover the hole. Okay. Let's say that's our first thing then. We need to get to the hole. Like this. But you said after scaring the top lady. So scare her? No, that doesn't scare her there though. Like that. <gasps> That's a way to scare her and then knock the shelf. That's one way. But I don't know if I'm supposed to knock over the other one. Scare lady. Don't touch the other shelf. So I need to figure out a way to do it without touching the other shelf. And I need to scare her to the left. Thanks, Leech. <laughs> so how do I do it without touching that shelf? Oh, I'm scaring her the other way. Right up. Wow, that's a crazy fucking way to do it, dude. That is so crazy. To do right, up, down, left, up, right, and then to it. That's fucking intense. That's fucking intense. Ah! Need to hit the phone after you scare her? God damn, this one's insane. This puzzle is fucking insane. 
So you right up, <laughs> down, left, up, right. Hit the phone after you scare her. Or after you kill her? Just so need to hit the phone after you scare her, then kill her. Bookcase, kill. Over, phone. Now, how do I get to this other bitch? This is an intense fucking puzzle, man. I could squish it with the bookcase? Is that what it is? Oh, kill her then, phone. Kill her. Oh! Then the cat. Does the cat get affected by the phone? Interesting. I thought the X was going to block it. I thought the X was going to block it. Damn, that's a fucking intense puzzle. Holy shit. How many moves does it take to beat that one? It's a lot. That one's insane, dude. Absolutely insane. Went to New York, but it seems like we spent all our time on this silly boat. I know, right? Wow. Crazy puzzle. So this one I need to lure... Yeah, they get crazy. I like that, though. I like that they ramp up. That one was fucking on another level, though. I think that's the hardest one we've seen so far. Um, I can kill the cat if I go into the phone at the bottom, so I can't start with it down. I can go up and kill the dude. I can go left, and that puts me in a bad spot. So I have to start with up. Has to be up. Another one of those lots of positioning. Fuck. I get this like weird habit of when I have an object, it's like I want to get there as fast as possible, but sometimes it's like you have to do some weird backwards ass way to get there effectively. So now that I'm here, I can do. Actually, I actually failed with up. No fucking way. No fucking way. Really? Are you joking? <laughs> I think the camera means you're joking. Legit? So I have to go this way instead. I have to do something like that. Probably not the answer. You probably need to go like around. Yeah, this one's gonna be really intense, I think. With the way stuff moves. Like oh mama goes to sleep. Dude, I'm gonna be going to sleep soon. Fucking killing me in this game. This is intense. I feel like I'm good up to this point. Let's do like a checkpoint system. Bus can tell me if we have reached a checkpoint or not. <laughs> if this is good. Because we at least have like somewhere to, to base around. Because I don't think I'm going to get some of these. They're insane, man. These are insane. Negative? Rip. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, this is the starting level, right? Checkpoint, yes or no? Lots of positioning, man. Crazy. So I need to move people around even more. Ah. 
Good for now. Okay, so last time what I did was I went and I hit the phone and I scared this girl. But maybe I'm supposed to do something different. The other option is to kill her, but I don't think that's what I'm supposed to do. I can either go left, up, right, which hits the phone. Yeah, the soundtrack's dope. It's really good. It's really good. You have to check out this uh, one other mode. I think we're really close on beating some of this. Uh, at least like this chunk. I'm kind of curious. If we uh, back up. How far are we on the level select? Okay, this is the last one in this, uh, in this area. I want to beat this today. And I'm going to try the the kill combo thing real quick if we can beat this. Depends how long it takes. So if we're good up to here. Did the people switch? They're different. Yeah, they're different than last time. All right, so if we're good up to here. I went and pushed the phone last time and that was not going to work. What's the hint for this one, actually? Why is there a kitty here, Jason? Scare it up out of the way scare it up so that means I need to go in here and boop it up that way I feel like I want to do this and scare it up like that but then this person, and like uh, this person here, is not going to get hit. Oh, rip. Yeah, that was not what I was trying to do. For some reason in my brain, I was just like, the cat's out of the way. I can't, I can't fuck up the cat now. But no, I can. I need to scare somebody else into that trap. Someone else needs to head into that trap. All right, sounds good, Baldrick. Sounds good. Scare down right, then up left. That's what I tried last time. I did like this. And then if we do up left. I wish I could scare this person over here so I could kill this guy. Blocks the other kid and you can go down. We go down like that. I'm trying to see exactly what's blocking. phone thing in there um how do i get you to go into that trap this fucking cat man
If I go all the way around the side. I can scare you over. But then there's still the issue of the trap. And getting the cat out of the way. Yeah, so the cat's spooked, but how do I... Yeah, I figured... I knew that was wrong. 100%. But how do I get that cat out? If I hit the phone at the bottom, does it see the cat? It only pushes him there. So that's what I did. Maybe the delay is uh, delays too long. Scare him over, then go back to the bottom phone. So I scared him over, went back to bottom phone. How would I scare the cat from here, other than hitting the phone? Top table. Hmm. You have faith? <laughs> Put a cucumber down. That'll do it. the cat against the phone. I had that a while ago, right? I don't want to murder the cat though, right? How do I bump that cat up? Scared that dude. But then we're fucked. Because I can't get to this other guy. So now we're stuck in the same spot again. After murder lady on top. This one? Or is it somebody else that's already dead? So is it solvable from here, or do I need to rewind more? It's 
puzzle's fucking nuts, man. Scare the cat to the phone. Scare the guy without hitting the phone. Okay. So I need to go like this first, is what you're saying. Kill that chick first. And then scare the cat back. From here. Right? Kitty. Okay, go back. I'm gonna end up murdering this person. I don't know if that's okay or not. Maybe it is. No. How do I go back without murdering her? Because if I do up, I kill Cat. If I do right and then down, I kill her. Oh, I see. Kill her first. Um, uh, oh, that's not it. Kill her, scare Cat. Yeah, they can't both be in that position, right? Welcome back, Baldrick. Welcome back. What joy it is <laughs> beholding me. Top right table blocks you, then go down and then scare the cat. Top right table. You mean the chair or like this? I'm only seeing the one table. Yeah, this one's really, really hard. Super hard. See, so yeah, if we hit the phone, they're already there, right? I feel like I need to rewind more. Like, yeah, we can't do it at this point. This is too many people at this phone, I think. Like, we could get in here and scare the cat. You're redoing it? Okay, cool. Yeah, let me let me know what you find. This one's tricky. Really, really hard. <laughs> they are. It's a really tricky level, man. The thing is, I can't go backwards because the only way out of here is go down. I can go left. Up would kill, right, down will kill. And then I'm stuck. Run into him one by one from start. Start over? Okay, yeah, let's do it. This is fucking crazy. All right, so from the top, <laughs> it's fucking game, man. Holy shit! 
I think we need to go all the way around the outside. Go like clockwise. We start with Scare Cat. Okay, we didn't do that before. So we start with Scare Cat. And then I think we go clockwise all the way around, right? And Scare Person on the right. Okay, around a top phone. Boom. And then what? Then phone again so that we get them both to move. I think it's loop around clockwise. Pretty sure. Could be totally wrong though. This is a crazy one. Yeah, clockwise. Kill the girl. And then spook the guy. Right? Pretty sure? And then I need to get in there. Yeah, scare guy. Then I gotta go around... ...to sneak in between him and the cat. Like this. Spook come in. Jesus Christ. What a level. Wow. Wow. <laughs> this voice acting. Yeah, thanks for that in school. Crazy, man. Unreal. Just your entire squad enemies of your friend for honor. They're trying to do their best at me. <laughs> nice, dude. <laughs> EAD. EAD. Woo! Yeah, so there's quite a few more to these. Like, we did um, all these levels. All these levels. Plus, quite a few more. We did all of them in here, all of them in here. And we just unlocked. Last resort, spring break. There's still like all these other ones too. I think all these come by default with the game as you kind of beat them, they, they unlock. And then there's also these DLC levels as well. What are they anyways? Let me check. Return to Crystal Lake, nice. Killer Stocks London, but not that one. The Ripper. Dungeons Decapitations Nightmare. Nice pun. And Crow Magnon Manslaughter Jurassic Jason. So yeah, there's tons and tons of levels to do. Pretty crazy. Let me show you guys this one other mode. Let's murder marathon one more time. I'm gonna try this a couple times, see how far we can get. See a bunch of murders. Should be good. My highest is 20 so far. Because they progressively get harder and harder. And the music is awesome. Damn good music. Alright, here's what's gonna start getting a bit more challenging. I'm not keeping track though. Of how many we're at. Yeah, adding a counter would be good. To see what you're at.
Ooh, that was close. Almost early on that one. Good. Okay, this is getting harder. Oh god, cat, don't fuck this up. Oh my god, she's just gonna jump up the keyboard. <sighs> nice. And here's the prize we've been so far. No! What did we get to? 23, it's not bad. Not the 30 we need, but that's not bad. Damn, man. I knew for sure that was the farthest, just based on the way that the that they were kind of showing up. I hadn't seen ones that were like right at the edges yet. All right, let's get ourselves this little crate. Butcher knife. Put that. Very cool. Anyways, another little kind of fun mode in here some achievements in there to grab. We got a few left that we need to hit up. What are we at for achievements after one sitting today? 37%. Not bad. Not bad. But there's still tons and tons to do. Should be good. Should be good. Alright guys, with that, I'm going to be calling it for today. Let's, uh, let's find ourselves somebody to host. Somebody to love.